Hello everyone, this is Alan Hernandez from DP Computing. We are located in South Australia and we specialize in computer repair, consultant support and many other different services to help you with your computer related issues. Today in this video I would like to teach you how to organize and save what you consider to be your favorite websites to your browser and to your desktop. The topics that we are going to be learning are as follows. I will teach you how to add websites to your Internet Explorer favorites. Also, I will teach you how to add those websites to your desktops as shortcuts. Just so you know, this can be done if you are using Windows XP, Vista 7, or Windows 8 as long as you are using Internet Explorer as your browser. Now that we have covered the basics, let's get started. The first thing that we're going to learn is that I will teach you how to add websites to your Internet Explorer favorites. So let's get started. The first thing that I'm going to do here is open my Internet Explorer browser. It does not matter if you have version 6, 7, 8, 9, or 10. Internet Explorer would be similar as long as you have the Internet Explorer browser, which is this one in front of you. What I'm going to teach you in this particular video will not relate if you are using Google Chrome, Firefox, or Safari. It will only be related to Internet Explorer browser. So, what we want to do is basically for you to determine which websites you consider your favorites. The way to know this is, me personally, is the websites that I use and visit often, like maybe my bank account, or maybe my social media profile, or maybe the news website, or maybe my email, and so forth. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to do several scenarios, give you several samples, on what I would do if I would like to save that website as a favorite. So let's just say that I like MSN.com to be one of my favorite websites. Why? Is because it has everything that I need to find out about news, social, pretty much entertainment, health, living, money, you name it. It's a great website that gives me great content. So what I would do is, if you look on the top right on the Internet Explorer, this would be 9 or 10. If you have Internet Explorer 8, 7, or 6, you will have the tool option on the top here and the favorites option on the top of the browser up here. I'm using a newer browser, which I highly recommend if you do not see your options above here the home, the star, and this tools option I highly recommend that you Google or Bing search Internet Explorer 9 or 8 and install it on your computer so that you have the latest browser. Either way, let's continue. So I'd like to save this website as one of my favorites. So what I would do is I'll click on the star option and then add two favorites and then you're going to notice that I have a list of folders that I can create over time. So basically, you have the option to create a new folder if you like. Let's just say this is what you want to do. I'll go into news websites, which is what this website is about. And then I'll save it under the bookmarks folder and create it. And you're going to see that when I save this, it's going to go under News Websites folder. And I'll show you really quick what it looks like. I'm going to name this favorite MSN for Windows 8. Simply Windows. And then I'll add it to my favorites. Another thing that you're going to notice, which I highly recommend for quick access, if you right click on your browser, you will have the option that says Favorites Bar. You're going to notice how that bar goes away. If I enable it, then I can just easily access my favorites like this versus going to the star option, choosing this folder, 
and looking through the list. It's about the same thing, but it's up to you. So you're going to notice if I click either this way or this way, that at the end I have recently cre created a folder called News Website. And there it is. If I look at the folder through this view, you're going to see that it's at the end as well. Very simple. So let's change and do this again. I'm going to go over to Yahoo. And Yahoo is also a pretty good website and I consider it to be one of my favorites. Not just because of the content that they offer, but also because I have Yahoo business uh, accounts and also mail that I use with them. So I'm going to save these websites as one of my favorites so that I can easily access it without having to type it in every single time. So again, the process is the same. I'm going to click on the star menu, add to favorites, choose the folder that I want to add it into. In this case, it would be the news website, Yahoo, and then add. The process works the same way. If you're looking for the website and you like to visit that website, open your favorites list go down to the folder that you created and there it is. The same way if you go through it this way and then you open the folder down in the list and there's the folder that we created. So let's say that you like to save a website into a folder that you already have not necessarily creating a new folder. It's the same process the only thing you don't have to create a new one. So let me show you. I'm going to go over to AOL, which again is also a great website. So I'm going to go over to Save, Add to Favorites, and instead of creating a new folder, I'm going to simply choose a folder in the list. And it's going to be created in, name this whatever you want, and then add it to your favorites. Very simple. The process is the same if you like to look for it, and there it is. Anytime you want to go to any of those websites, all you have to do is find the folder, find the link, click on it, and it takes you to it. Very simple. What I like to teach you now, guys, is basically how can you add those same websites or specific websites to your desktop. If you like to do this, you can also do that. What you like to do is basically go over to your desktop and right click on your wallpaper. There's going to be an option here that says new and then you go over to shortcut. Once this option comes up you want to type in the entire website that you would like to add to your desktop. So I already copy the website so I'm going to paste it. And there it is. The next thing you have to do is simply go next and then name this website and I'm going to name it MSN News whatever you like to call it and then finish very simple and there it is if any given time I would like to visit this website all I have to do is click on it and open it very simple so the option is up to you do you want to just add them to your favorites on your Internet Explorer or do you also or only want to add those websites to your desktop? It will be all up to you. I want to say thank you for watching this educational video from DP Computing. We will continue to create and provide you with additional videos in the near future. And I look forward to helping you guys if you have any given problem. And if you have any questions, so please do not hesitate to contact us and also stay connected with us on social media. Okay, so uh, what I like to say is, is if you have any questions, like I said, please come over to our website, which is dpcomputing.com.au. And as I said earlier in the video, we are located in South Australia. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time.